The former Vice President Joe Biden shared quite an emotional moment on The View with co-host Meghan McCain, uh, one that really uh, went beyond politics. Uh, the Vice President was there to talk about his book on the tragic loss of his son, Beau, who passed away from an aggressive brain tumor back in 2015. Uh, Meghan's father, Senator John McCain, was diagnosed with the same cancer in July, but continues to serve in the U.S. Senate. Mr. Biden called her father one of his best friends. Absolutely no introduction. Joe Biden himself is here. All right, this is the hard part. Bear with me, okay? I couldn't get through your book. I tried. Your son, Bo, had the same cancer that my father was diagnosed with six months ago. And I'm sorry. But there's a lot of hope. Babe. I think about Bo almost every day. And I was told, I'm sorry, that this doesn't get easier. But the you cultivate the tools to work with this and live with this. I know you and your family have been through a tragedy that I couldn't conceive of. Well, look, what look, would look, you look, tell look, people? Look, 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 it's look. not about me. It's about everyone. No, 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 it, no it, 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 it is about everyone. But look, um, one of the things that gave Bo courage, my word, was John. Mm -hmm. Your dad, you may remember when you were a little kid, your dad took care of my Bo. Your dad, when he was a mill aide, who worked with me, became friends with Bo. And Bo talked about your dad's courage, not about illness, but about his courage. And look, there's a lot of things happening. Any of you have somebody who is diagnosed with glioblastoma, which is about as bad as it gets, there's breakthroughs that are occurring now. There's four things that are going on. And, it's, and it can happen tomorrow. Like, for example, at the University of Pennsylvania, where I teach now, there is a, at, the, at the Abramson Center, what they found out is a thing called a CAR T cell. What they do is they, is they take the cells, your T cells, their immune system cells, out of your body, and they reinforce it with an antigen. And that goes in and that finds the cancer cell, because the cancer cells can hide from the, your immune system. And they had a breakthrough with a new drug that dealing with child leukemia, and it's working. Mm -hmm. There's other things called, they, 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 they have a, a, what they did with Bo, it's starting to happen now. They're using this CAR T cell, and they're using an ant, a, 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 they inject a virus. And it generates into the, into the cancer. In, and so there's hope. And so, so there is hope. And if anybody can make it, your dad, her dad, <laughs> is one of my best friends. Her dad, her, her dad goes after me, hammer and tom. We're, 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 we're like two brothers who were <laughs> somehow raised by different fathers or something uh, because of our because of our points of view. But I know, and I mean this sincerely, and I've said it all, even when your dad got mad at me and said I should get the hell off the ticket. Um, <laughs> is, no. <laughs> And, 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 and do you remember what I said about your dad? I said, I know, and I mean this sincerely, I know if I picked up the phone tonight and called John McCain yep. and said, John, I'm at Second and Vine in, in, in Oshkosh, uh, and I need your help, come. He'd get on a plane and come. And I would for him, too. Yeah. And this is the guy. But look, the thing that I found, the thing that I found, was, and Bo insisted on, your dad's going to insist on, is you've got to maintain hope. Mm -hmm. There's hope. Hope is, you have to have hope. Senator John McCain tweeted a clip of that interview with a message. Thank you, Joe Biden and the entire Biden family for serving as an example and source of strength for my own family.